Now, I find that when I was in school, I was never senior prefect. I couldn't have been. And I was never, uh, those days in the primary school, we call them monitor. I don't know why they call them monitor, but that's the name we call them at that time. Class monitor, instead of a uh, prefect, I mean some parts of uh, primary school. But you know, I was never a monitor or janitor or prefect or president or anything. I was just a student. But do you know that? Just thinking back, and I think back a lot, that's how I learn. I have to look at life, analyze life, and uh, bring everything back together again. You know, I remember the prefects and monitors in the primary school. I didn't see any of them succeeding. Yes, they were neat, and uh, whenever they come, whenever they came to, you know, the student assembly, and they stood before, they stood while the teachers were lining up, and they stood before them, uh, beside them, you will see that he, by the posture and appearance is good. If this is the monitor, and when he goes around the school compound, finds any of us in the lavatory, and will say, all of you there, come out. Or when they had a law in the uh, in the primary school, never speak vernacular, always uh, speak English. A law I broke every day in the school. <laughs> You know, when they put, when they have their paper in their hand, and they will say, I catch you again, William, you have spoken the uh, vernacular. I will say, hey, I didn't there. <laughs> you know. But you know, I watch all those prefects and monitors. They didn't pass their exams. I came to secondary school, and I found again that that senior prefect, my niche, tall, the, the personality was wonderful. You know, he didn't pass his exam. I came to university and I saw the president of the student union in our own time. And all those people, one by one, look at their lives. This is what I find in their lives. And now I'm no more a student. I'm now a preacher. But I see the people who are prefects among Christian workers. Great, great evangelists. Their personality, their posture, you can see, very, very fantastic. But you know they are not succeeding. They have crusades in the north, in the south, and everywhere. But look at their use of language. They don't understand how to use language. Communication, they don't understand. Interpersonal relationship, they don't understand. Even the preaching is only money they want to collect. And you see them all over life. Learn from life, like I learn from life. I really sit down and I think. And I try to learn from life. And if you... If you're a Christian worker and you say, Lord, all these things that have happened to other people, they fell by the side of the road. I don't want to fall like that. I want to succeed. But one of the things I found among those uh, prefects is that they oppressed those younger people under them. And the leaders that oppress workers will not be considerate and see the needs of the people that are subordinate to them. You know, they will not eventually succeed.